you're talking about juveniles in possession of a weapon on school property. That's very serious. An altercation at Jefferson Middle School led police to finding a loaded gun in a bathroom. FWCS spokesperson Chris Stockman says tips from students ultimately led them to it. We rely on um, you know people in the building and our own investigations uh, to find the weapon quickly and to confiscate it without incident. Um, and so fortunately that's what happened that did happen yesterday. Police say it's rare for students to sell weapons at school. Usually they say they bring it for other reasons. Usually the first reason the most popular reason is for protection. They'll cite some incident that happened at school. Officer Raquel Foster says students also bring weapons to show off. Although police say it's uncommon to see teens sell guns at school, they can understand a student's thought process behind it. I'm not surprised because actually in the schools when you have so many students, so many people, um, that just makes for a bigger market. A letter was sent home with students explaining what happened at school Monday. Stockman says FWCS does not have plans to change its security measures because of this. Officials feel their protocols already working because they say that's how they found the loaded gun. Through our investigation, we dealt with the students um, that we needed to deal with, um, found the weapon, and took care of it. As for the three eighth grade students involved, they may be put into alternative programs or expelled from school. Two may also face felony charges. Stockman continues to encourage parents and students to speak out if they suspect someone may bring a weapon at school. Please let us know um, because we want our schools to be as safe as the students do.